What's your favorite science fiction news show? What is this, a joke? It's called no. SFN. Is there any other science fiction news show? Not really. Not no. really, no. Hi, I'm Jeff Rector here in Long Beach for the Long Beach Comic Con. I'm here with a group of beautiful stormtroopers. Beautiful and deadly. We're here at the entrance to Long Beach Comic Con. Let's go in and check it out. I'm with longtime friend Brian Stoller, who's here promoting his new movie, Wizard of Paws. Great to see you. Good to see you, Jeff. Yeah. Uh, I understand there's a special story behind your dog, Bear. Well, Little Bear, uh, he's been in a bunch of bunch of my movies over the years, but he stars in uh, First Dog, and he stars in The Wizard of Paws. And uh, First Dog was was actually inspired because I found out he was he was fostered by Nancy Reagan um, 13 years ago. Well, I actually got Bear from. Uh, from a lady who told me he had been rescued and then a month later she called me and said I didn't tell you who was the rescuer but it was actually Nancy Reagan uh, this was 13 years ago and so I got a chance to meet Nancy um, she wanted to see how little bear was doing and wanted to meet me and that's what inspired me to uh, to make the movie first dog with little bear um, and bear was such a good actor that he's been doing a bunch more movies and his latest one now is called The Amazing Wizard of Paws. It's really amazing uh, how he takes direction and it just, he kind of fell into it. He, uh, uh, you know, he takes direction just like, like a five-year-old kid would take direction. Did you have to go through his doggy agent to, to book him? Uh, he actually had an agent at one point, uh, but they went out of business because I don't know if I would, if I would lease him out or not for other movies. And he's a service dog too, is he not? Yes, Bear is. Uh, I've been taking Bear to like the children's hospitals and uh, various hospitals and schools. Uh, he works with autistic kids. He's gone to retirement homes, and he's been licensed for probably for about ten years doing that. And uh, uh, people can come by and meet Little Bear and say hi. And if they're interested, they can also pick up his DVDs. They can pick up First Dog, and they can pick up uh, Amazing Wizard of Paws and they can get their picture taken with Bear inside the uh, First Dog movie mobile. You're good. I'm here with the beautiful Natalie Popovich, of course, Ivana Cadaver from your uh, TV show. Yes, Macabre Theater. Macabre Theater. You were the hip, young Elvira type. Why, thank you. God, you look fantastic. Look at you. Well, thank you, Haven't Dolly. changed. Thank what are you, you doing Dolly. Now? Well, you know, when you're the undead, you don't change, you know? So. So what separates you from the other beautiful, buxom genre hostesses out there? <laughs> Very good. Uh, I Well, what I like to bring to the table is I like to get out on the red carpets and handle, um, you know, uh, for instance, this past year, out on the red carpets, so Harbinger Down, uh, big feature films from the big studios, as well as the independent studios. So I get out on the field, I uh, do interviews with the indie filmmakers, I do indie, uh, I do uh, interviews with the big studios, I cover DVD releases, um, you know, with all the studios. Of course you do. And uh, That is it. That's okay. it. You are it. I am it. I'm back with Ivana Cadaver because I just can't get enough of her. And we didn't really talk about your, your show, and, and where is it right now? So it's on a new network called U2 America, originally created by Mark Burnett, um, and it's in 210 markets across the country. Uh, thrilled as can be, I'm so happy about, uh, about this. And it's the first social interactive network uh, that's ever been done. So it's kind of like Facebook and Twitter meets broadcast. So it's very interactive. There's an app on uh, on U2 America that actually uh, you download, and you can download 30 seconds of fame. So you just say, you know, my name is such and such, and you know, my favorite horror movie is Night of the Living Dead, and I love it, Ivana, and and it's awesome. U2 America. Red, white, and you. That's it. Perfect. Macabre Theater. <laughs> Hi, 
I'm very excited. I'm here with Captain America. Hi. Wow, you look great. Well, thank you. You've uh, trimmed down a little bit. Just a tad, no. And longer eyelashes, from what I remember. Yeah, eyelashes, eyeliner, lipstick, all that. Uh, I was looking for Red Skull earlier, but I didn't. I haven't seen, seen him around. Oh, oh that's right. You already yeah. killed him. Yep, he's already long gone. Captain America Civil War is coming out. We're very excited about that. Oh, yes. Most definitely. What would you like to tell the science fiction fans out there? That Team Captain is the one to side with. And that really, Tony Stark is going to lose. Team Captain is the winner. You heard it here first. I'm here with the famous Robbie the Robot from Forbidden Planet and a million other shows. Wow, looking good. Yeah, give him a little oil later. I'm here with Harlequin on rollerblades and Steve Rogers, Captain America, I guess before you got the super soldier serum, huh? Yeah. You're the you scrawny know. Captain America. Hell yeah. Yeah. That's how I roll. <laughs> but you're the original. I mean, you were the guy that loved America so much that you enlisted. Yep. Yeah, show him that. Ah, show him those look rockets. At that. What are you laughing at? Nothing. <laughs> did you make this yourself? Yes, I did. And uh, wow, that's a big hammer. What are you going to do with that? Put it in the garage when I'm done with this convention. <laughs> I was hoping you were gonna say some sort of crime fighting oh. thing, but I it's just going in the garage yep. when you're done. Do you uh are you, do you do you you're a roller skater obviously? Yeah, because Harley Quinn joined the roller derby. She did? Yeah, in the new fifty two comics. I guess I'm behind on you excited to see the new Suicide Squad movie? Yes I am. What about you, Steve? I'm pretty excited for it. I was, I saw that trailer. I was like, "Whoa, I'm ready. I'm ready for it." That's exciting. That's a, that's a big excitement. I saw, um, you know, I saw some Agent Carters running around. You better, you better grab them. No. <laughs> sure. Sure. Whatever you say, sir. Whatever you say. I'll go do it. <laughs> Thank you so much.